how that's how we talk, when we talk about this the height of pressing for the mark of the highest calling mm -hmm. is when we're able to be excited pre-excited about our fellow human being like pastor nanji just shared where we prepare we prepare accordingly that as i'm going on this journey now there may be another brother or sister i may meet god on the road yes god and we're talking about god where two or more come together like the samaritan who saw god lying on the street because if we do not see like that if we do not develop that clarity that this is god we are seeing dr allen somebody may challenge you as you know people always challenge you in louisiana about your understanding of god you know <laughs> they always challenge us everywhere so you will tell them this very clear this is why Esau and his brother could do what? Reconcile. When they finally grew up into a pure heart maturity, when they were no more about tricks, when they came to recognize each other, that they have the same what? Divinity. Cherishing the shared identity that makes us one is the same divinity. When now he could say to his brother, when I see you, Jacob could say to his brother, my goodness, when I see you, it's like what? Beholding the face of God. See God. Mm -hmm. Now you see yes. maturity. This was somebody who was one time wanting to kill. They want to kill themselves before, right? Yeah. Yeah. I and Dr. Allen started about how the world believers are encouraging others to go kill others mm. and that's why we are sharing this until people can recognize god in each other yes. not belief system not say no um now I'm only i will only love my christian brother i will only love my jewish my zionist or my hamas or all this compartmentalization but when we come to that matured state where we see god in each other life change everything change everything you no more there's no more this need for this belief you know you say i you know god the father god the son god the whole you know uh, all these rituals we jump all around and we want to persuade like the, you know people will declare oh um jesus is my savior uh, muhammad is my savior reverend moon is my savior uh, all this nonsense it's actually nonsense let's be very clear says the holy spirit if i cannot see god if i cannot do as the good samaritan if the israelite the jew cannot go help the amas or the the palestinian if they cannot do that if if we the americans who claim we love jesus so much this sunday we are going to be if we cannot do as jesus said turn the other cheek we are not saying go and um, let people kill you no we are saying act responsibly as a fellow human being how would you treat god how would you treat god let us start with that how would you treat god somebody are you going to tell god well god do you believe unless you believe that's when i'm going to give you water to drink are you going to do that are you going to declare to god your fellow human being in need they're going to tell you, do you believe in Jesus? Now I'm going to pray for you because you have received Jesus now. Then I'm going to feed you. Oh, then you don't come back. You come back only in Thanksgiving to give them food. Say now you're doing your good deed. Your church come out on Thanksgiving Day. To, that's it. And then you never come out again. And you want to tell somebody, no, you don't know God. You don't know Jesus. You don't know nothing about life. You have been part of the problem part of the problem congregating today again in buildings that will be espousing things like let us pray for one person one group of nation only they're, yeah they're doing that dr allen they're going to pray for one nation let's pray for this nation so that this nation you know the other nation we don't pray for because somehow they are devil i don't understand but they are not human beings I, I i don't get it right the lord is exposing the synagogues of satan and we pray we don't be part of that yes 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 
Anyone who cannot have compassion like Jesus, Yehoshua the Christ, does not know God, does not have a pure heart, is caught up mm. in a belief system. And belief system kills people. It kills, it kills each other. So today, that's the prologue for us to come into this great, great gathering of magnificent ones. Danji with her magnificent self is ready to sing. Mommy Bayo with her queen self is ready to sing. Dr. Allen already gave me a brief. He gave me already, uh, uh, without Jesus, since he made Jesus, his life has changed. And <laughs> his life is still changing because he wants to help the world really yes. receive yes. Jesus, not just yeah. by, by words, by mouth, but mm -hmm. by action, by compassion. By action. Mm -hmm. Sing for us, Dr. Allen. Mommy Margaret, then you. I'm coming, yeah. I will. Hi. Because we, we want to enjoy. Maybe I start it off so that Dr. Because Dr. Allen sang first. Let me just, because we're going to sing today. Your messages will be sung. We, we, we already shared our heart to an extent. Come, we have friends to the garden of Eden. Where the spring blossoms are best, joyfully singing together a song, friends in a Eden regain, regain here in the garden together we'll meet, singing new songs of joy. Come, we give friends to the Garden of Eden, sing in new songs of delight, joyfully dancing together with song. Friends in the Eden rejoice, rejoice here in the Garden together, we'll dance. Singing new songs of joy, singing new songs of joy. Come, oh my friends, to the garden of Eden, where joy and happiness reigns. Joyfully sharing together our love. Here in the garden of peace, come, boy, come to the garden, my friends, singing new songs of joy, singing new songs of joy, come, 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 my friends, to the garden of Eden, where joy and happiness reigns. Come, oh, come, singing, oh, my friends, where the kingdom is here. Come, my friends, let's sing new songs, singing. New songs of joy, singing new songs of joy. Doctor Aaron, uh, <laughs> listen. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just listen. Uh, I'm gonna try this. Yes, sir. It's in the songbook. Listen. Everybody gonna pray. On the last day, hmm. when they hear that hell brings the world away, everybody gonna pray mm. to heaven on the judgment day. Yeah, well, you can sing about the great King David, and you can preach about the wisdom of Saul, but the Judgment falls on all mankind. I'm on hush right there. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Yes. 
<laughs> it's time to sing about the last days when judgment, yes, is already upon mankind. He says it will begin, it will begin where? In the house of the Lord. Judgment. And judgment is being cast. Yes, the synagogues of Satan are being exposed. This is the truth. This is not theory. This is not conjecture. If you are not part of God, you will be known clearly say, by their fruits. By their fruits, you will know them. You will know them by what we bear. And unfortunately, the church has been part of division, killing, slavery, bombing, all types of atrocities that we can never associate with Yahushua. Mama Nanji, are you ready? Or Mrs. Bayo, which one is ready to, ready, for the next? I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. ready. Yeah. <laughs> you are born ready. Come on, come with it. Don't wait for your cue. Already join the flow. You know, okay. when, water, when water and water meet, you don't see the difference. Come on. Flow with it, mommy. Why should I be discouraged? Hmm. Why should my heart be in trouble? Hmm. Why is my life in distress? Hmm. When Jesus is always there. Yes. When Jesus Jesus is my portion, a constant friend like him. His eyes is on the sparrow, and I know he watches us. His eyes is on the sparrow, and I know he watches us. So we sing. <laughs> Because we are happy. Happy. Because we are free. free. His eyes is on the sparrow. And we know he washes us. Hallelujah. 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 Somebody. You got a you got a redeemer, a God who watches over you. Oh my Amen. God. Oh, oh yes. Go to yes. God with the glory. Blessings. Blessings. We just have to pause a little bit because if we look at the message of that song, it is an assurance. Mm. It is an assurance that Amen. God is ever present. That's why we sing. We sing because we are assured. We are what? Assured. It's a yeah. blessed assurance that God, we are where? We now rec recognize clearly that we live where? Where do we live, Mommy Bayo? In God. In God. In God. Uh, where do we move? In God. In God. Where do we have our being? In God. God. In God. So what, what is there not to sing about? What again? If you're in God, Mommy Nanji, in that wonderful house, apartment, place where God has allowed you to be. If I am here in this yeah. same place, um, Aaron, same place, Bishop Wagas, people, uh, we are assured, you know? Yeah. Hallelujah. Mommy Bayo, what's your song yeah. for today? Come, come, come. Okay. Yeah, I will sing when I behold the Lord. Oh my goodness, when you behold the Lord, oh my God. What happens when you behold the Lord? Sing for us, precious. Okay. When I behold the Lord of all, my old self dies away. So died the right of sinfulness, giving us to good. Emerges, pure and bright and pure. Come and be behold a new light, heaven and earth are I behold Jerusalem, city of loveliness, gently descending from above, ever to be my own. Yes, 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 yes. So never ending it with me. Long at the Lord is near. Yeah. 
Joy ever flows in sweetness, river of precious life. Kingdom of God eternal, fervently I desire. Heavenly lake so soft before shining the sun of grace. Glory, 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 glory. Springing for us in life, fruits of the tree of life. Tament of doubt is over. Gone in the shadow of doubt. Something every part of me. Sinfulness roots my soul. God can let me purify, giving creation to me. Let me live in His palace, shining with God and light. Unless His love and time and Boundless is love and kindness. Boundless is love for me. Sinfulness rules my soul. Still God can let me purify, giving creation to me. Let me be his Kingdom of God, kingdom of God, eternal. Thank you, mommy. Wow, you're muted, Pastor Nanji. Thank God for that beautiful music coming through everyone today as we arise to always cherish the divinity of God within each one of us. And through song, it says, make a joyful, joyful noise, you know. Uh, and, 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 you know, joyful noise will always come with something melodic because we, we want to offer uh, joy to God. We want to offer joy. You know, we've been using the language, um, the new phrase, it's new in the sense that um, 
it, 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 it's what is being introduced and there will always be new ways, new ways to express God. We call it the new phrase, joy fuel, joy fueled, not joyful. Yes, joyful, you're full of joy, which is the, what that is saying. Joyful means full of joy. Now we're, ask, we're adding the fuel. What are you full of? You're really full of joy. So joy is your fuel, your fuel, your gasoline, your energy. Uh, isn't that, wouldn't that be the best energy for every human being? That, that, that joy, it is joy that drives you, nothing else. Joy joy for the other joy for you joy for yourself joy for your family joy for your sister joy for joy for everything everybody around you joy for anything you know we put it another way it says the holy spirit you know the best prosperity is what we wish we pray for one another to be prosperous prosperous in what the things the good things we desire we do the good things we participate in and what what does that good thing what will it result what will come out of a good thing? It should be joy. Joy. Joy, joy all around. Joy while you are doing it. Joy while you are participating in it. Joy while you are engaging in it. If it's not joyful, then that, that, that must mean, wait a minute, what are we saying? Our God is a sadistic God. The life is created for us to suffer, to have pain. As we say, no, uh, uh, no pain, no gain. Yeah, really? Uh, joy and pain is that really is that really 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 how god this loving god this god who wants us to be like god wants us to go through pain before we find joy really or is it just because we just go astray we just don't understand because if god created the world again very good very good somebody echo that very good right god created the world very good or very bad very good oh Thank you. Very good. I didn't hear any way it says very bad or terrible. I heard only good, good, good. So how can we now somehow put bad up top or come from, the, from our root as saying our root is bad? How did we get caught up in this type of mental exercise that makes us think somehow uh, people are born bad? People are wicked, are evil. As, as somebody wants to tell me that the Bible says you are born weak, you know. No, you are born in, in, into sin, into a situation, into hu this human situation that does not understand how good and wonderfully made we are. Again, in the scripture, the Bible says we are what? Pastor Nanji, wonderfully made. Pastor Antoinette, wonderfully made. And then, we should act wonderfully as that as we are made. If the Bible says we are, I, I, oh, okay, maybe let's not even believe the Bible then. No, but the truth is truth. So the Bible tells us we are wonderfully made. The scriptures, one of the many scriptures, the psalm, the psalmist particularly, echoes it. So if we are wonderfully made, we are wonderfully made for what? Wonderfully made to suffer in misery, to cause each other headache, <laughs> you know, to torment each other. Is that what we're we experiencing? Experience wonderful? joy in life. To experience joy, beloved. That's why we're wonderfully made. That's why we are together. No other reason. Why would two entities come together to an annihilate each other? No. To experience, to experience joy. That word in self, experience, you know, to come into a realization for, for your system to, 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 to say, wow, I never felt like this before. Something new. Right? Something new. Something that's good. Something that's precious. And we want to say something that's priceless. Because if this is not priceless, it cannot sustain itself. No, it cannot. You will get bored with it. That's why some people get bored with certain things. Things that are not priceless. They get bored. After a while. Because it does not have eternal value. When something does not have eternal value, 
it cannot produce joy consistently it cannot excite you consistently only that which has what eternal value will excite us consistently so we ask the question now somebody will say who is that what is that we know clearly that is you say god god has what eternal, eternal value absolute value god so if i and we here in the world especially we religious brothers and sisters those of us who claim to know god very well people who have titles like the man or woman of god we should exhibit what same eternal value is that right or wrong shouldn't we yes yeah so what we are saying what the holy spirit is saying is that we have what divine value pastor antoinette do you have temporary value or divine value what type of value do you have divine value. amen yes divine value, divine value. That's what every one of us, we are made to have, we are designed by God to have what? Divine value. Because God, God has what? Divine value, eternal value. And God sought to do what? Share. God sought to impart, put into us share with us god's value not into some not into some not only into the man not only into the woman and not only into certain community not only only into the believer or the non-believer doesn't have it not only you say in the the catholic you know, in those demarcations that try, what those demarcations many times are doing that separate us is trying to say you, the other person, does not have divine value. That's what it is. All this differentiation. But when we realize that every differentiation is just another unique expression of that same divine value. So we use the word unique truth body. Unique truth body. That we are all part of that expression we call God in unique divine expressions that still represent the same equal value as a living soul. And this is where, if we can ra not wrestle, go through as we are going to go through now, as Mommy Bayer will come and open those scriptures that we had yesterday and we will continue on that consciousness to help us realize how to cherish the divinity of our shared identity how to realize that all of us as I all of us have the same identity all of us not some of us we are all equipped with that I that I will say in community. Without that I, there is no community. It is I that makes community. And that I is also present where? In everyone. So come, Mrs. Bio, lead us in the menu today on that we have um, from the very beginning what the Holy Spirit has prepared for us this weekend. Let us follow accordingly. Yes. Okay, today the, uh, um, the menu. I put forth email. The unchanging, restorative, universal presence, and the power of collaborative I in community and providence 
of Bang family in love God. The earth, this is the same scripture uh, from Psalm 24. The earth is the Lord and the fullness thereof. The next is from Acts of Apostles, chapter 17, verse 28. For it is in him, in God, we live, move, and have our being. The next, the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 5, verse 48. Be ye holy, as God is holy. The next scripture from Genesis, chapter 1, verse 26. Then God blessed endowed them to be fruitful, fruitful, multiply and subdue in the divine steward over the earth. So the Namaste family, this wonderful golden scripture and more are guiding truth light. He means to guide humanity into a divine, in the allying, healthy, heavenly relationship with people, all things, place and solution, heavenly couple, Holy Spirit Association for Heavenly Life Consciousness, the co-founders and convener participated in the National Lead Prevention and Environmental Justice Awareness Week, which took off is a very successful kickoff at the Richmond, Virginia Executive Airport, Chesterfield, Virginia. In attendance were a primary lead advocate, group founder of UPAR, United Parents Against Lead, the Shabazz, Mrs. Uh, Mr. Stephen, and Mrs. Takia Shabazz with her mother and other community partners. Below, we are grateful to be part of the partner that took you to an area for a real photograph of five a chemically toxic related potential water poisoning site, including the home of Shabazz, where they discovered the problem of lead related house plot that was the reason for their childhood family health problem. Join us and thank you for joining today. And uh, the danger and solution, the why, where, what, and how. Why should we all pay attention now about how to access resourceful programs on how to inspect one's environment for lead and other household products that may affect our total health name will be in the true family mindset is first and only the uniformity rather and unity of diverse unique truth body to harmonize for joy and betterment of all the first Corinthians chapter 13 sharing the greatest gift ever, love. Yes. Thank you, Precious. Thank you so much again for going through all the menu um, that the Holy Spirit is allowing us to serve um, this, this weekend, this strong end of the week. And as we begin the first, um, the first um, day of the week, we say Sunday, we are grateful for those highlights um, as we reflect on God's goodness again. Um, 
back to being excited about seeing God's work coming through each one, through each one. Um, we cannot over um, emphasize, but we must always emphasize again on this beautiful um, tide. There's a tide uh, as Jesus, as Yahushua um, um, ordained that um, in our life, that once we tarry, once we focus, we seek first the kingdom of God. It is in seeking first the kingdom of God, we, we other things. It says every other thing um, we, we need, um, you know, even we want. Um, our needs will be taken care of and whatever that it is that we need will be added um, unto us so when we step into this realm which is a realm where all humans all our fellow friends brothers and sisters are, are called all designed i just called they are all designed to enter this true family realm true family realm a realm where we celebrate what us celebrate us not some but us and until we enter that realm um, this is a realm Yahushua uh, Jesus is, is guiding and calling all of us into when Jesus prays the way he prayed for us say we should pray our father um, our oneness our our not my our our we we have so many beautiful clarity as it relates to examples how we should have followed as jesus said follow me follow me when jesus said follow me he said emulate me copy me copy me do as i do do as i do isn't that beautiful do as i do say as i say meaning think as i think if it, it starts there as the menu shared today from the heart whatever we do if it doesn't come from the heart the heart is not just this heart pumping blood no the heart is that well of reality a well of of reality that contains god love that contains essence essence that's why your heart when it stops beating you are dead so mm -hmm. if it doesn't come from the heart that that depth of 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 true primordial reason for why god created remember the heart is where god dwells that's the that's you know this body just is is this shell but the mm -hmm. heart so if it comes from the heart it will always come from where god is mm -hmm. It will not come from any other place. If it comes from just the mind, that's why they say the mind. There's a Christ mind, there's a carnal mind, and there's the other mind, right? There, there, there are two minds, two minds struggling. So things that come from, you know, just rationality and the mind, eh, you can try to figure it out, and you always want to use logic. Logic never ends. But when it comes from the heart, it trumps logic. This is why Mami Bayo, they say the love, is stronger than the principle love trumps the legality of any law no matter how even dynamically divinely that law is love god's heart that's why god can pardon you can have mercy on us we can also have mercy but if we follow as the bible says, dr antonette the law says death legality the principle says you must die you committed this offense. You are a terrible person. Mm -hmm. But true heart, Christ likeness, God, true love, does what Jacob did. Mm -hmm. Jacob mm -hmm. now repented. Mercy. His brother also, Esau, mm -hmm. got the same. Mm -hmm. They could now synergize. They could now see themselves in that word Jesus God has revealed to us universe as universe as siblings as a united sibling. He could now say to his brother who wanted to kill him, "When I see your face, what do I see? I see the face of God." 
You see how beautiful that is. So the cherishing of the divinity of our shared identity is the real path to help bring all of us to subjugate any false um, energy that wants to divide us into permanent camps of we against them. The only way we can cross that bridge, it will never be with belief. It will never. It will never. It must be with persons, and it is with persons like Jesus, who is beyond belief. Because if Jesus is still believing, then there's trouble. That means Jesus does not know. But Jesus knows. Yeshua knows. So he could explain to us clearly, our, our Father, our God. Everything is from one source. We are of one parentage. So treat each other that way. Love each other that way. He gave us narratives, stories. Not just um, stories, but narratives. Principle guided narratives to help us recognize that we are one. Mm. Mm. So the Lord is so clear these days. When we see around us the darkness that comes closer the other day somebody wanted to darken our sister's light yeah mm. yes they want to pull her back pull some of us back into the mm. old way mm. of conducting we say we we know god no we don't know god belief system what well, you believe and knowledge two different things so they want to many people want to pull us back to act like the old way and the old way has not done what? It has not produced this joy, this harmony that we all need to sing about, to rejoice with, with each other. When I see my sister, my brother, I see the face of God, shouldn't it be joy? Why should anything else come about? Huh? Should it, oh, do you know God? Who are you? How do you believe in God? Uh, well, okay, I'm Baptist. Oh, no, I'm Catholic. No, I am Methodist. But my Methodist Bible says you must do like, oh, really? Oh, my God. We are going to the same grocery store to buy food. We are going, we are on a car trip together. <laughs> You're right about that. Suddenly, you found, how, how, is, how do you find an enemy in two persons who believe in God? Tell me about it. Uh -huh. Somebody should help, really help us, help the world. How do we find an enemy in somebody, in two, three persons who all claim they believe in God? And suddenly there's an enemy. How did God become one of their enemies? Tell me about it, Father. I don't know. How? So it must be that somebody has been misleading us. Maybe charismatically. You understand what that word means, right, people? Charismatically. Mm -hmm. Social engineering is charismatic. Oh, it's exciting sometimes, you know, mm -hmm. when the person speaks, so and we don't check it out. Mm -hmm. We say they are under anointing. What anointing is that? <laughs> no. <laughs> it's hysterical. You know when somebody is hysterical? Mm -hmm. Let me help somebody. There are so many hysterical persons now rolling around on the church floor somewhere. Oh, sure. Oh, sure. Just like there were hysterical persons last night at a concert, mm -hmm. at a rock and roll concert, mm -hmm. screaming, loving the guy who is singing, loving the woman who is singing, oh screaming their heart off. Oh, Pastor Nanji used to scream her heart off for the Beatles. <laughs> oh, yes, I do. In those days. In those scream. days, let's be honest with each other. We used to yeah, scream out for James days. Brown. I scream my lungs off. Oh, sure. Yeah, Michael Jackson, those days. Michael Jackson, all of them. Hey, Mami Bayo, don't, don't smile like you did not you did not have your own idol that you you you, mm -hmm. you like. Everybody. So, but people get stuck there, thinking now, they transpose that same type of just excitement energy that is that will fade away. That's why after church service, it fades away. After the concert, it fell away. But you know, you still like Michael. You still listen to his music. Mm -hmm. But Michael is not your God. Not at all. Just like the pastor at the church or the bishop or whatever, he's not your God. You got to research for yourself. You got to do some work for yourself. 
Bible, like the one who was going, he put the white robe and was going up in the heavens. He said that seems the pastor says going in heaven, like Jesus, the angels are going up in the sky. So many people now start going to the church. If that pastor can go there, they too can do the same thing. I said, Jesus, okay, theater, theater, theatrics. How does the magician, you know, David Copperfield? I know. <laughs> it will make you disappear in a minute. Like a magic. <laughs> it will make you disappear. I mean, you would think everybody there will be bamboozled. Say, oh, now another man of God is this. Yes. Make a aeroplane disappear. A whole aeroplane. So you see, when we get stuck, when people get stuck, as we again back to that wonderful cab ride, Uber ride. We have to have fun. Oh, I meet my sister, my brother. Oh, how are you? Oh, no, no. just we need to talk about life and encourage each other. Oh, be well, you know. But suddenly it has turned into um, a killing field. Yes, because somebody in that is ready. If they reach a junction, let me tell you why it's a killing field. If they reach a junction, if they're not, there were junctions, places where there's 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 um, religious police check. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Now you're about to enter another person's area. They ask you, do you believe or you don't believe like he believed? Oh, he will tell, my, oh no, Margaret does not believe like me. Oh, I'm Baptist. She is not. She don't know God. Uh-huh. I'm telling you something true. A killing field. That's how it happens. Oh, yeah. He was so angry. Angry. Just let me carry you home. Because I said, but if you receive Christ, now you think that you then why are you angry? Yes, that's my temperament. I said, Oh my god. I said, but I'm smiling, we're not we're not cold, we're not fighting, we are just talking. Oh my god. He was so angry, Father Bayo. Until he like he was driving that van, that metro says van like he like he almost wanted to like say, drop us here and let's get out. Oh my god. <laughs> now, now he was so furious. He was so furious. Brothers and sisters, this is our Sunday True Love Culture University, and we, the Holy Spirit wants us to be very real and transparent because we have to make our God love real, not an abstract um, assumption. Um, and in assuming, that's why the, 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 the word assume is a very terrible word. Uh, people assume, you know, you assume that sometimes somebody sitting with you even on the pew of the same church and we want to go beyond assume we want to go to the heart and say no i really know this is my brother or sister regardless of how they acted as pastor nanji acted so beautifully smiling and you know you're still my brother my sister i don't you know I, why should i be angry with at you for what reason you just don't know better that's all you just don't know. and once we receive that more and he asked me, can you imagine the image he gave to me? As soon as I was speaking, I know that you are talkative. I said, ah. you don't know what the talkative That's what he told me. He said, yes, I'm picking you. I see, I know that you are talkative. Why your sister, why your friend don't talk? I said, because you have a different name. My name is Margaret, your name is you. So if I talk, I'm talking what's making sense to me. If you don't think it's sense, that's why we have, we have conversation. Dali, Dali, don't worry. Margaret, because you did not talk about, you did not affirm his own narrow-minded belief. Now you become a talkative. If you had, if you had affirmed, if you had affirmed, oh yeah, yeah, yeah everything you said. Now you're no more talkative, right? Thank you. Hey, so, we we'll, we'll work like you. Yes, it's so. Important. Yeah. So this is a ch childish. No, it's not about baptism. Then he's baptized. I said, when you baptize, baptism. When when you baptize, now you're an adult. You baptize. Then you're angry. If you're a baby, then baptize. When a baby, you didn't do anything. You don't know anything. Then now that you know something, then you get worse than the baby who is in the hand. That's what I told you. <laughs> you get worse than the baby. That's why you could have baptized, baptized like the baby and don't know more about that as an adult when you still have that temperament in you. And you say you are quoting scriptures to give to people. That's what you're good at. As your pastor say, it's written in the Bible, Mark chapter 16, verse 6. Let me go and read it. Who don't believe in Christ? I said, what, Jesus? I said, okay. I said, I hear you. What Bible do you read? I said, I read Bible that have Genesis to Revelation. That's all the Bible I read. 
<laughs> and that's all the Bible. Every Bible, Genesis to Revelation. I don't know which other Bible. Is there any Bible that has Genesis to Revelation? <laughs> Bible has Genesis to Revelation. Uh, no. Uh -huh. They want you to only read the King James Version. The authorized, the authorized King James Version. The new King James Version. Do you have the new King James Version? I say whether it's old, is new. Whether it's the voice. The same Genesis to Revelation, right? Genesis to Revelation. That's the one you read. Yeah, so, <laughs> sorry. So, so sorry. So, brothers and sisters, the reason we are, we bring this to light on the air um, as part yeah. of. As again, this is a Sunday True Love Culture University. In many places, you would not hear real life testimonial about the truth. As you all know, um, this is a Naked Truth project. Um, you know, we have to live a transparent noonday life. Our, our love for God and each other um, has to be very transparent. And it's going to go through challenges. We love brothers and sisters out there listening to us and those of us here as we encourage one another it's going to go through challenges and that's why we want to be always clear we want to shed light god's light the holy spirit wants to wants to really um, um enlighten us as jesus said um, so many things not one small thing or so many small so many things um, on all aspects all aspects of life all let's use another good word all interaction Mm -hmm. Again, all relationships, how we relate to people wherever, on the train, on the plane, in the bathroom, you know, on the sidewalk, in the grocery store, um, again, in the police station, in the courthouse, wherever, in the White House, you know, how would you behave? Would, should, should, should Pastor Nanji behave differently if that was the president or if that was our, our, our um, you know, our, you know, we should always know that, hey, our, 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 our we, we're always in the presence, right? Always in the presence, okay. always in the presence. And once we're always in the presence, oh my God, everything changes again. Always in the presence of God, everything changes. So the conversation with anybody takes upon a holy tone, not, not, not offensive, not, not, not um, this aggressive, not, not controlled by emotion, but controlled by that desire that you, you want to really please God. You want God to be pleased. Mm -hmm. And this is what we see coming so beautiful. So we're going to shine on together. This is the last Sunday of the month as we come to 11 a.m. Mm -hmm. um, a good number for one and one. Today's message again was about the community, in the I in community that makes of one. Everybody is an I, right? Every I, even that brother who did not yeah, know. He just, I, everybody has that I, right? So you are the I in unity everybody's that i so if i if i function properly if i can recognize the other i too get this if i can recognize everybody as an i i and i we are all in community we are the i in unity in community so without you your i i am not my i cannot exist because you make me exist if everybody now if every if, if anybody is so so self into themselves or so into say God or oh, okay, let everybody disappear. Mm. Let's see how much you're gonna enjoy this world. No way. You can mm. exist by yourself. Mm. You cannot work. So this is part of again the collaborative I is always there. That's God who says that I am that I was, I am. I am that I am. So God is manifesting in all of us in unique truth bodies unique but same quality mm -hmm. same essence same divine value same same no difference however we must know how to play our role very well mm -hmm. always in the presence of god yes, and that changes everything so as as we are here now as we go out the next bus driver or the next taxi driver or the next whoever we still we carry the same. We don't change. Mm -mm. Our attitude, our demeanor about people don't change. So we are excited. Like, a, you know, one time, as we said again, let's just recap. When we were young, when we saw some people who irritated us, yes, our spirit became irritated. Our spirit became closed. 
ah, why this person, as pastor say, she, she jumped the other side of the street quickly, mm. pretend you don't see, <laughs> have to cross the road. <laughs> have to cross the road quickly. <laughs> so bad. So, but now we can walk on the same road. I say, hey, hi, my sister, hi, my brother, regardless, regardless. And you no, don't now, force it. Now, Father, but you know they do that, they're on the phone. <laughs> you see, pa Pastor Nadia has master. Sorry, Pastor. I stop giving the mastering all these ways of avoiding people. So you will bring out your phone quickly. Yes. <laughs> you are talking to somebody when you're not talking to anybody. You're not talking to nobody. Look at that side. I'm sorry. It's okay. So we 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 again by their footsteps you know them, and okay. so we pray that we just recognize these things. As, as so as to say hey brother i see you how are you though even though you're on the phone <laughs> even though you're on the phone i see you so again back to how we always conduct ourselves in such challenging situations um represents how we are more in unity with god's presence mm -hmm. so uh, we are very much encouraged by what is coming through everyone to an extent because anyone who, even, who is not even doing the right thing can help you grow, right? Not because they are, you know, because you are going to grow based on, wow, I'm not going to act like that. Amen? You're going to grow. You, you see an example that is not the way we should act. So that will strengthen you. That will give you strength. Oh, no, that's not a good way. And so we hear the testimony of Pastor Nanji helps us to know, wow, that's not the way a true Christian, a true human being, a true friend, a true divine spirit okay. robed in flesh should act. So, brothers and sisters, we are so grateful. Let us close today. Any one word, word, mommy bio, um, that you would like to, you would like to share to the world based on today's sharing about divine value, um, and all that you've heard, any encouraging one statement or anything on your heart uh, as it relates that you would love to encourage um, the human family, our wonderful human race. Uh, go ahead, Aya. Yes. Uh, thank you so much, Father Bayo. Um, we pray that we can find our Okay. True identity and divinity in God. We are the delight and seek God's eternal value and to be a person and enjoy happiness. Love. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. So we continue to echo that across the board that we find this is we discover and those who seek those who seek will do what they you shall see. find they will receive yeah, sorry. Yeah, no you're right find, they, will, yeah. they shall receive you seek well enough you will find meaning you will receive and those who ask um they get answers so pastor mm -hmm. you give us your closing one word or Anything the Holy Spirit Antoinette, Sister, today. Antoinette. Sister Antoinette and, and Margaret, please share. Yes, Pastor Bayo, just, just one second. One Take second. your time. Okay, mommy, okay. So as we are yeah, grateful. Sorry, yeah. mm -hmm. It is well, yes, Father Bayo. Um, we thank the Father for the anointing upon your life, your wife, upon the ministry and everyone on this platform. You know, every day we come to receive and every day we come to also to give back to God. To acknowledge that and recognizing that he's our father, he's our everything, no matter our differences and situations we're going through. Remember that he says, you know, don't let don't we let us breathe on all those dry bones. Because those dry bones will become fresh and they'll become they'll start to walk, take another step. And those dry bones are the ones that we thought that we know when we don't know. So when we know now what it is, because we breathe onto them, now we start to walk and talk the talk. Because that love that comes from the heart, you say it's not the blood that flow is in it, is a substance that, that comes from what we do. 
yes. what we do to each other and how we show ourselves, how we portray our characters when we are out there, when we are inside, even when we are by ourselves. Mm. How do we portray our character to God, character to God, when we take it as an idol? And we also are the idol, but we, we destroy ourselves not to be the idol because we want to take power over him. That he does not have the power that he has given unto us. We are better than him, which is very wrong. So this, this sheer identity that we are all God's children is one orderly manner that we are going to eat because we are all created from this earth. Yeah. And this earth is who we are. Yes. The heaven and the earth is who we are. We are the earth, and everything is in it, as you say in Psalm 24. So where do we go and look for something we know that we don't have? Mm. Before he created us, he said, I've created the purpose and plan that I've created for you has been fulfilled. So where do we want to go fulfill again when we are already on the earth? And are <laughs> speak, us speak, sister. And give us all what is good and nothing is bad in there. Is we are the ones making it bad. And think that God make it bad. God does not make it bad. We make it bad because we were disobedient and make it bad for ourselves. So that's where we had the punishment. They have love and passion for us. That's why he forgive us and grant us all what we can have again back. But yet we, we still go and just do the same thing again. And they will not acknowledge that we have wronged him. Even to say, Daddy, I'm sorry. Or go on our knees and say, Father, have mercy on me. Or call, call, confess to your brother and sister and say, I am sorry for what I do to you. It's difficult nowadays. But brethren, you know what? On these platforms, I will call it forms, in the, because there are so many of them we go. Yes. The true one that God has called you by purpose and plan, this is one of them in the name of Jesus. This is one of them. And I thank God for what we share every day. Yes, I know some people say, ah, we thought Father Bai is going to preach like the other preachers preach. And we thought Father Bai is going to prophesy like other prophesy. And we thought Father Bai, this is all prophecy. This is all preaching. Preaching and the word of God that proceeds from our mouth is what is real. It's real to the core. It's not that substance of faking. We don't fake on this platform. Amen. We don't fake on this mountain. We yeah. don't fake in this place. We do what is real. Look at us go environmentally. Look Amen. at us go deep down. We celebrate one another on this platform. Amen. I will never tell that my birthday or anniversaries or something, or even when my mother died or sister that you all can be celebrated on a line like this. Bless you know, God. if we don't go further, how do we know that there are good things are there? Mm. If we don't go out and if we don't communicate with one another, and if they say invite you, say bring somebody, just come. Be, uh, be attentive, as you say. Listen. Be attentive. Be, uh, pay attention. And you see what will happen. The next minute, you are part of that group. If you are not part of that group, you are taking what has been said on this group Hallelujah. to go and share it out there. So that others will know that this is what we have been cajoled from the beginning. That we, as for one, I told you that even on the other platform this morning, I said I was scared of eating apple. You can't know my throat is gonna speak. <laughs> Sorry, so, so when, I, when we all come to know that he's sex, so like, okay, just like our, our bishop Patrick said, when he preached yesterday, she preached yesterday, and mm. somebody said, Oh, for real, it was sex. That's how they asked me the question for real, it was sex. He said, yes, it was sex. What do you think it was apple? No, it wasn't apple. So, can you imagine a, imagine of people today who don't still know that that apple they think the apple is apple. Yes. You know that it's sex because pastors don't go out there and preach the truth. You know? So thank you, all, Father Bayo. Thank you, Mama Yano. Thank all of you, Holy Spirit. Thank you for this mountain that we are sharing this one identity to walk in a godly, orderly, divine manner so that we too can be like Christ. We don't go out there and pick and choose. We don't go out there and say, I am better than you. We don't go out there and say, you are white, I am black. We don't go there and say, you are rich, I am poor. We are Oh, flesh and blood, the same, the same. The Hallelujah. Same <laughs> blood. So thank you for that Bible, for that anointing of God Let's that will go. never ever run dry for you. Hallelujah. I receive it. I receive. We receive it. I know. And then you receive. We all receive it. And we share Amen. it all around because we Amen. celebrate but one life together. Amen. We celebrate the divinity of God. In each other together. So we're looking forward to celebrate brothers and sisters this whole week. We're yes. getting ready. So hey. yeah. yes, you received the email from the from Bishop Adel. I'm looking forward though. Let us send though.
Please choose the time I can available to be. To celebrate Pascha Nainzi. Yes. So we look forward to the email. You said Nigel is going to send me some email, right? Yeah, we'll send emails for the preparation of our Saturday, yeah. Yes. We put it together, uh, as usual, yeah. Obviously. Me, 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 Rosny, me and Rosny in the Dominion of God, Antonella will be added because she is also the November 11th. Rosny awesome, November 11th. awesome, Antonella. Yeah. yeah. Rosalie, yeah, uh, wonderful. Rosalie is November 18th, so we all are Dominion of God sisters. So yes. We are all oh, it's going to be beautiful. It will be so, beautiful. So. This is the theme song we are going to be playing all week and all year round now. So let us yeah, enjoy yeah, it. Dr. Lewis better make me a different song. Yeah, Dr. Lewis better make me a different good song. Uh -huh. Yeah. 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 Celebrate our divine yeah. oneness If we congregate to celebrate life every moment yeah. Let's congregate to officiate and celebrate Yes! Make we make no more delay It's time to delay. Be Don't hesitate, let love have the way to see All we have to do is say let's celebrate Make we congregate, it's time yeah. to play again We yeah. are making hay, rising up to a sunshiny yeah. day Let's yeah. make no yeah. way for love to come at one's way each and every day of this we pray. So let's celebrate. Celebrate. Make we congregate. Make we congregate. Them coming. Them coming see them. From the north, from the south, from the east, and the west side. See yeah. them coming from every side. Every no side. Way inside. This is the love that should be signed. Yeah. Let's yeah. pay no more taxes for our collective genocide. Pay no more taxes. Hebrews, no. Jews, and <laughs> In every heart there is a child. When every heart wants to play, if they use the your money to clean people. Stop. With this caravan of pain and gains, everyone hitches on and hangs on for the ride. From this reality, no more can we hide. This is love. We celebrate so still and true. Always standing by my side. Yeah. My head still out of sight. So come, oh come, come, would you come? Let us celebrate. Come, come. True lovers of God, would you come? Make we eradicate, confiscate, obliterate all the systems of hate. Love is governed by fate. Faith in love. Faith in love. Faith in love. True faith means good works. Show me your faithful works. Huh? So let's celebrate. Let Show me. Let's love. celebrate, Nanji. <laughs> we are celebrating, though. Oh, Yes, sister. Yes, we are we're gonna celebrate God in real time together, all of us. We are universal siblings. We are all. We are one. This is your turn. We are all. We stand as one. No more, no more, no more. No more. We are we're not divided no more. But come celebrate, 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 celebrate. We are us. We are us. We are us. Yes, we are us. We are us. We are us. Universal Savior. Just for somebody who didn't know that. We are so grateful, brothers and sisters, as we come this light of goodness that is all abound around us. God is doing some amazing things in all our lives. And let's just continue to cherish one another. There's no other way to realize the kingdom of God so easy, so on time, so direct than just we acknowledge the divinity of our shared identity. We are brothers and sisters. Stick with that. God is around you all the time. And if God is around you all the time, you said it already, Mr. Christian man. You say God watches over us. He sees everything. So if God is seeing everything, is God happy that you want to do something that is terrible to another? Cannot be. Cannot be. You want to think of another a different way? No. 
So we are so grateful for everybody's testimony here. And those who have not been able to testify, please receive, receive truth. The apple never existed in the garden in the Middle East. Figs exist there. So it doesn't make sense. The story is very clear. Very clear. The man made them fig leaves. So how apple come into that story, I don't... Again, very simple cajoling. Very clear. No apple tree grows in that area. Fig. The man is in the Bible. He says he made them fig. So if you even want to make some conjecture. Exactly. If you want to make even some slim conjecture. Do it in a way that don't think people are, are, are daft, you know, come on. So, let us know each other as God wants us to know each other. Man and woman should know each other the right way, in the pure way, to love each other, care for each other. Those who are married, do the same, brothers and sisters, should continue to love sister and brother the right way. And so we are grateful. Brothers and sisters, have a wonderful day, week ahead. Some of you will see you on Tuesday. 7.30 where we continue to understand how we're going to do this celebration because we really want to celebrate. This. Yeah. Aya, we really want to <laughs> celebrate because the time has come to do what? To celebrate. The time has come not only to celebrate but we're going to say this thing spirit. let our light so what? Shine. shine. Uh, let our light so shine that that, wow, that. so the name of the Father will be glorified. Repeat that one more time, sister. Let your light shine. So what? Why? 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 Father will see the good works, and the name of the Father will be glorified. Amen. Amen. Uh, without without the good works, there is no. We say glorification. Mm -mm. The good works, the good works that Pastor Antoinette is doing, the good works that mm -hmm. Adel Kima, Bishop Adel Kima, is doing, the good works. Mm -hmm. That all the God's Dominion Ministry sisters are doing. The good works that Heavenly Couples International all around the world is doing. The good works, yes. The good works some great Baptist church members and pastors are doing. The good works some great Catholics are doing. The good works some great Episcopalians are doing. The good works some Pentecostals are doing. The good work some Palestinians are doing. The good work some Israelis are doing. Some Jews are doing. Some Zionists are doing. Some communists are doing. Some 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 Zenoph they are doing is out there. That good work we want. We are going to help it shine because the more we can see it is good work that the Islamic brother is doing, the more we begin to understand. Wait a minute. Some Christians also do bad work. Some Christians also do good work. Some Islamists also do bad work. Some Islamists also do good work. Some some Republicans also do bad work. Some Republicans also do good work. Some Democrats also do bad work. Some Democrats also do good work. We are one. Our nature is the same. So we're going to do what, mommy? We're going to do our best to shine the light on our good works. Okay. Collective shine. Eh? Let our kings be lifted up. Our kings. Our queens. Shine. <laughs> Let us sana ring to our story. Let us rebrush the trend of everybody seems to be in such a hurry. Why, Why everybody is such in a hurry? Even breastfeeding the major for life. Even breastfeeding. Go straight to the bedroom, soon end up in the courtroom, sitting in limbo because the kings and queens almost forgot how to live. We forgot how to use the living room, especially the dining room. My brothers and sisters, food is this love. There is more love for heavenly children. Do most let the true love light shine. 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 Let all God's people lift, 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 lift them up. 
This is the new train, we are here to reverse Turn your true light, don't shine the light on me I want to rise out of the spare, breathe fresh air again Live as kingdom seekers again Children of a heavenly kingdom right here on earth Right where I sit right here with all the giants that dots the night sky I am, we are still heaven's favorite star So let's shine, 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 shine on Shine, shine on Whoa. Let all the children be lifted up Shine, shine, shine on God be the glory. Let's keep shining. Thank you all so much. Uh, if we had a 24-7 studio, we would stay here all day, all night. And the time <laughs> Yes, the time must come when we stay all day, all night, so that people know that God is ever present. Not just sometime, but all the time. Yeah? All the time, all the time. So keep shining wherever you are. Through you, God will be present wherever you go, wherever you are, wherever you speak, wherever you are. Let God's brilliance, God's brilliance, just come through, come through always. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Namaste, family. Peace. Shalom. Salam alaikum. Bye for now. Bye.